All right, all right. Hey guys, welcome back to the Underground. Today I'm going to be sharing a quick and easy guide to help you step by step to install and run the Alien Isolation VR mod by Nibre. Uh, this is going to be using Windows 11 computers as well as the Steam VR version. This mod does already work with the Epic Launcher, but with Windows 11 and Steam, uh, it has a couple issues. But don't worry, I have a quick and easy workaround for those brave enough to try out this amazing VR mod, which I do highly recommend, by the way. So let's go ahead and get to the chase. Uh, First, you're going to want to make sure that you have Alien Isolation installed on Steam. The other thing uh, you want to do is go ahead and run it once and then exit. This will make sure that it gets the files installed on your computer that you're going to need. Next, we're going to go to your browser and type in Mother VR Mod and you'll see the GitHub page by Nibre and you'll just download the latest version which is 0.8.1 and you just download it right here and then now uh, we are going to go to the file location of the game uh, which you can easily find uh, by going to the little gear icon going to manage going to browse local files and you'll see your steam apps common folder here uh, what we're going to do is we're going to copy this actually we're going to cut this file from here the alien isolation folder and then you want to move it to anywhere else on your same drive i of course use my trusty desktop mods folder and then we're going to uh, paste it into here now really important that you do this next step you're going to take the folder and rename it and then you just all you're going to do is remove the space in between alien and isolation now we're going to create a symbolic link to the folder that we moved to do this click the start button on the taskbar type in cmd and then right click command prompt and run Ooh. as administrator now all you have to do is type in mk link space forward slash d space and then use a quotation marks and then begin typing in the first path uh, for the common steam apps folder this should be the same for pretty much everybody uh, using windows 11 common backslash alien space isolation and then do quotation marks and then another space and now you'll do another quotation marks and then you'll type in the folder path to where you've moved it to which is c for me um, colon backslash users backslash the username backslash desktop backslash mods backslash alien isolation without the space and then quotation mark and just hit enter now we want to go to where we downloaded the mother vr mod and we want to uh, extract the files there i'm going to be extracting it into my mods folder into the mother vr folder and extract there and then you're going to take this dxgi file i'm going to copy it go back to and find the alien isolation folder and all you got to do is just drop this little file into here and that's it so after you've dropped the dxgi folder in there go ahead and start up steam uh, this will of course be using a gamepad for this uh, the sense controllers button mapping does not necessarily work properly so you want to use a gamepad i'm going to be using just a dualshock 4 and then go ahead and start the game. Now first we're gonna have to enable the Steam VR runtime. So now you'll see the Mother VR options here and you'll want to go ahead and go to VR runtime and then change and select use Steam VR. This is of course going to uh, restart the game or just close it and then you just go ahead and start it up again so now you'll be able to see the game main menu within the headset uh, but there's a couple settings you want to uh, fix before you get started go back to mother vr go to input and then i highly recommend if for if you don't like snap uh, rotation like me go ahead and turn that off 
as well as going to uh, rendering and turning off clip blinding. And now you can play Alien Isolation in VR. Isn't this so much fun? Uh, 